All right, Sean, uh, Hammer and Nails Moffin Buyer, there's been a bit of talk about you lately, uh, and it turns out you just found out you're still under contract for a little longer. <laughs> <laughs> so I want to ask you what you have to say about that. I mean, crossroads, all this jokes we always make. Uh, what's going on in your life these days, Sean? Not much. Just uh, doing a little bit of work back in Kamloops, uh, just helping a contractor in town and just kind of enjoying my fall more or less soaking it all in and trying to make decisions so from grace or autumn excuse me oh you said for your fall oh <laughs> <laughs> right over my head you're way too old at these references but yeah that's a, that's what's going on all right so we're here at the uh, yamaha ride day we all been on the 2023 you saw me fall over there you came by and laughed at me <laughs> I hurt my leg, by the way. <laughs> I fell back because I saw you shaking your leg. I'm like, oh, I probably tore his ACL on it. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> no, okay, so we're out here trying the new bike. Uh, is the new bike something that's like, you know what? I got another gear in me. What, what, what are you doing? We got to ask you. What are, your, what are your thoughts? Where are you right now? It's a pretty dang good package right out of the uh, stock platform. So, um, yeah, obviously it's crossed my mind to, you know, push on another year and see what we can do with this thing. But I don't know. We'll see. Still, uh, obviously, the fall and... Still lots of months to go here before we get racing again. So, yeah, I don't know. Lots of decisions to be made, but yeah, pretty cool to ride that bike. Almost, I think we're some of the first people in North America to ride it. So, it's uh, it's pretty cool. It's, a, it's special to be able to ride that bike. Here it's it. Nice. Now, as far as racing goes, do you feel like you have unfinished business still in the 450 class? You just want another year because you can't think of what else to do, <laughs> or, or you know what I mean? Are you still loving it? What's what's the, what's your attitude heading into? You know what I mean? Like, what's yeah. what is your decision based on? I think honestly, I had so much fun this year with the team and the guys, and just did my normal process without all the COVID stuff involved, and it was a blast. And and uh, I think it proves when we're having fun and working together, we can make good results. And I think with this new bike, it's, there's even more potential. So. Um, yeah, I mean, it's it's hard accepting real life and going by an hourly wage kind of sucks too. So uh, it's pretty special to be able to you know have these guys contact me and want to come racing. And so you know, just looking at whether that's something uh, I want to take advantage of, like Tyler, for as long as I can, or you know, just be satisfied with what I've been able to accomplish and finish it off. But yeah, some decisions to be made for sure. Nice, man. I think I speak for everybody when I say we'd love to see you out there. Obviously, you still got top three speed or better. Uh, yeah, man. Well, good luck with your decision. Good luck with the rest of the fall. I know you're still under contract. So I think <laughs> you still have work Whoops. to do. <laughs> I know, right? Well, you know what? I should have checked that before I said that. I was really going on a limb there. But I swear I saw October. But no, thank you. Appreciate All right, buddy. There's still some hot dogs left. Let's go. Cheers.